What's going on guys? Welcome to Everything Always. My name is Michael Roman and as the Marvel Phase 4 slate has slowly started back up but is now in full swing, we're back into spoiler season today. A brand new plot leak for Doctor Strange in the Multiverse of Madness with a ton of new details that we haven't heard before, much like the one we just did for Spider-Man. We're going to read through it word for word, issue the normal spoiler warning, try to contextualize it with everything we already know and what this can mean for the upcoming Doctor Strange second installment for his franchise. But first, if you could grab the subscribe button, we're still giving away this insane one-fourth scale beta ray bill as well as our third and final infinity saga box set next month if you want to be entered to win all you have to do hit the subscribe button then leave a comment down below and if you want stick around at the end of the video we'll get into all the giveaway stuff again there also quick side note i know everybody likes different kinds of music drum and bass is especially fast and sort of outside on the fringe but i just released a brand new drum and bass track on impossible records it's a collab with the legendary edm drummer kj saka some of you may recognize him from the band Pendulum. Either way, if you're morbidly curious, just want to support or actually want to check out the track, there's a link down in the description and comments below. And either way, I would sincerely appreciate you guys checking it out. Okay, so first up, obviously the normal spoiler warning as it pertains to these anonymous plot leaks. This, of course, making its way around 4chan and then hopping over to Reddit. As is always the case, remember to take anything that doesn't directly come from Marvel Studios with a grain of salt. But in the past, it's these 4chan plot leaks that have been the most true. So knowing that going in, if you're susceptible, to this kind of thing or it's in any way going to ruin your Marvel Phase 4 or your Doctor Strange and Multiverse experience, you've been warned. As well as, guys, don't go to 4chan. By the time we normally cover these plot leaks here at the channel, it's been a couple of days and they're actually on Reddit, which is safe to go to. And when I can, like in this video, I'll overlay the text. But where they originate on 4chan, it's not a safe site. Don't go there. Okay, so this plot leak starts Doctor Strange, Scarlet Witch, Mordo, Wong, and the Ancient One all return. The new characters are Clea, Jericho Drum, America Chavez, Caglia Nostro, Nightmare, and Shuma Garath. Shuma Garath is an ancient entity that feeds off people's fear and wants to use America Chavez, a young girl who can create portals between universes, as a vessel to spread madness and consume the multiverse. Hence the name, the Multiverse of Madness. Nightmare is Shuma Garath's shape-shifting, mind-bending enforcer who is sent to capture America Chavez. Doctor Strange and Wong rescue America and assemble a team to protect her, formed by Scarlet Witch, Mordo, Clea, and Drum. Scarlet Witch is learning how to control her powers with Strange. Clea is the Ancient One's estranged daughter, born with a connection to the Dark Dimension, and of course we know what that means. With no time stone to protect them, this is obviously their connection back to Dormammu, as that was the thing that originally bargained for him to leave in the first place, and with Mordo's structure the way that he is, how strict he is in his principle, he's not going to like working with Clea if he knows that. Speaking of which, it's interesting that both Mordo and the Ancient One would return. The Ancient One, such a clear and poignant death scene in the first Doctor Strange, and of course we saw her in Endgame, but that was back in time. It seems to insinuate though that the multiverse means that no one is ever truly gone with infinite versions of themselves, and it's also going to be interesting to see if they'll finally explain what happened with Mordo between last we saw him wanting to take out all the sorcerers on Earth and now apparently back on their team. Maybe he understands the threat that they're facing and what they're up against and willing to work with them again only to stave off this threat, but really he seemed a long way from that in the way that he took off. They're going to need to explain explain that or at least give us some backstory as to what happened why he'd be back on their side. It goes on to say Drum is a powerful voodoo witch doctor and a former student at Comertage. Strange's plan is to contact the spirit of Cagliostro, the sorcerer who originally defeated Shuma Garath, and learn how to reproduce his ritual. Mordo decides that Strange's plan is way too dangerous, goes rogue, and sets out to kill America before Shuma Garath can get her. Now that makes a lot more sense. That's the Mordo we've all come to know and love. The final battle happens in Shumar Garath's realm of the dead universe is populated by physical manifestations of people's worst fears and nightmares, hence the villain, Nightmare. It goes on to say Benedict Cumberbatch, Chiwetel Ejiofor, which is a name that I only pronounce right every like one in four times, Elizabeth Olsen, Benedict Wong, and Tilda Swinton are all returning. Yeah, we, we know that. You said those characters were coming back. It says that Gomez is cast as America Chavez. That was a rumor that we reported on here at the channel, and that Davy Diggs is cast as Jericho Drum. It says that Bruce Campbell will play Dr. Druid, a Sorcerer Supreme of a parallel universe in a small comedic role. If that's true, I am all for it. You guys have to know Sam Raimi will usually use Bruce Campbell in a sort of, I don't know, cameo capacity here and there throughout his films. I, for one, love Bruce Campbell, would want him involved in the MCU in any way, and I hope 
that if they do work him in here as a Dr. Druid, whenever we make it to Secret Wars, some of these fringe and ancillary characters we get introduced this way can make their way into the final battle or into some scenes the same way that as they introduced all those characters at the end of Marvel Phase 3, they all showed up in the final battle for Avengers Endgame. Yes, please, Bruce Campbell in the MCU as a sorcerer, please, please Marvel. Please, please make that true. Of all the things that are in this leak, I, I just want it so bad. Jeremy Irons has been approached for Cagliostro. Charlie's Theron passed on Klee, which was recently reported. So Vanessa Kirby and Jodie Comer are the current frontrunners for that role. Nicholas Hout, who's rumored to have been in talks with Marvel Studios for the last six months, is in early talks for Nightmare after Adam Driver turned down the role. Now look, the inclusion of these characters in this general narrative and storyline is something that's been hinted at since back when Scott Derrickson was attached to the project. They admitted that this was gonna be somewhat of a horror film, uh, Nightmare obviously filling that role nicely, but it was widely speculated and sort of pseudo confirmed that once Sam Raimi came onto the project and Scott Derrickson left, they were doing a full on rewrite for the script and a lot of us expected they may be changing it where needed because of the delays in the way they they shoveled the Marvel Phase 4 slate and then moved Doctor Strange to the end when it would have come at the beginning that it may be a little more grandiose and require a lot more building through some of these previous series like WandaVision and Loki. That seems to be the case and although these original cast of characters were all the ones rumored to be, there have been several reports recently of a certain Andrew Garfield and or Tobey Maguire making their way into this film as well and you remember it was heavily reported across all news sites back when Marvel Studios reached out to Hugh Jack and Sir Patrick Stewart about Wolverine and Professor X in this film. I think there's a lot more here that we're going to see. And of course, the running joke of the channel has always been if even half the characters that are rumored to show up in Multiverse of Madness actually do, it'll be the most packed cast even since Avengers Endgame. For that, we're just going to have to wait and see. Guys, let me know all your thoughts down below. As always, I'm all ears. Do you think this is real? What parts do you think are real? And do you like where this storyline is going? Let me know in the comments, and quickly, let's get into the giveaway stuff before I let you go. All right, we're still giving away this insane one-fourth scale Beta Ray Bill and our third and final Infinity Saga box set on New Year's Eve. We already give away two here at the channel. If you want to be entered to win either of the prizes or any of the other prizes we announce here, all the same rules will always apply. Hit the subscribe button because you got to be a subscriber, then leave a comment down below because it's truly random. The more videos you comment on, the better chance you have of winning. Then in order to keep up with the videos, make sure you hit the notification bell with notifications turned on, and now as always, if you enjoyed today's video or the content, remember to hit the like button. As well as I mentioned right after the prologue, I'll mention it one more time. I have always done original music since way before YouTube. I still do now. I also stream over on Twitch. If you want to hear my brand new single on Impossible Records, a collab with the legendary KJ Saka, there is a link down in the description and the comments. You can't miss it. And I would sincerely appreciate you guys checking it out. I know different strokes, different folks. Music isn't for everyone, but just supporting me really, really makes a huge difference. You guys are awesome and have in the past and I would appreciate it again. Thanks so much for checking out the channel. My name's Michael Roman. Follow me over on Instagram at I am fires or over on twitch.tv forward slash Novellen, N-V-E-L-L-E-N. Links to both of those in the description as well. Thanks for checking out the channel and stick around. We'll be posting again real, real soon.